Hello, my name is Doc Wilkie and I'd like to introduce to you the SFS Mark I Survival Fishing System. The Mark I is a modern version of an ancient way of fishing that is still being used today throughout the world, both in fresh and saltwater fishing environments. And it has been in use since before recorded history. Now for the record, I am not the first person who thought of making this type of handrail or the person who came up with the idea of making them from polyvinyl chloride components. But they are a great concept and so I decided to make up some for those who would be interested in them but do not have the time or tools or a workshop to make their own. So with this said, I'd like to talk a little bit about the Mark I. Now, today, this makes a great survival fishing option. This method of fishing, fishing has a proven track record for catching fish and in a survival situation, that is what is going to count. The SFS Mark I was designed for the bug out bag, the bush pilot's ditch bag, or the backpacker who might want to fish while on the trail or a seaman who needs it for their lifeboat supplies. Now the Mark I, as you would receive it, has absolutely everything that you need to go fishing from the word go. And when you get it and pull it out of its shipping container, it's going to look like this. The first thing you'll see as you start to unwrap it is that you have your instructions that tell you both how to use it and how to change out the fishing line if you need it um, a different type of line because of where you may live. The one thing about the Mark I is, is that you can customize it to meet your needs wherever your survival situation might be. Like I said, this comes to you set up for the Midwestern River systems, which would be the Ohio, the Missouri, and the uh, Mississippi, and the tributaries. It's also good for the uh, most lakes and streams in uh, the Midwest as well. So with that said, let me talk a little bit about the unit itself. First off, it comes to you in battleship gray. The unit itself is nine and a half inches in length, inch and three eighths diameter here, and inch and three quarters up in here. It comes with 35 yards of 14 pound test with a snap swivel, and a rubber band holds the line in place when not in use. Everything is self-contained, which is why this is such a great system. No Altoid tins to worry about. It comes with two bobbers, and it comes with this plastic bag, which contains uh, extra sinkers, and they are uh, eco-friendly, which means no uh, lead. They come in an assortment of hooks, which allows you to fish from everything from bluegill um, to uh, bass, uh, crappie, walleye, perch, and catfish. Comes with extra rubber bands and an extra snap swivel. Now, you can customize your Mark I to do whatever you need it to. There's eight inches of storage inside this. Uh, it can hold extra fishing tackle if you want more, or you can uh, put survival gear in there, matches, whatever. Uh, but they do need to be in a plastic bag because the Mark I was not designed to be watertight. Um, the unit itself weighs 6.2 ounces and that's with all the fishing gear in it. So it's lightweight, easy to pack, it takes up very little room in a bug out bag or a backpack. Um, this type of hand reel is much more durable than the um, collapsible fishing pole. Uh, it has no uh, joints that will break away in a critical situation, has no gears that will jam. And uh, we all know Murphy's Law attacks us at the worst possible time. Uh, for those of you who are preparing for the SHTF situation, if it occurs, um, fishing is an excellent option that you should consider because uh, game animals will become scarce very quickly. So you will find that uh, fish is an excellent source of uh, uh, meat and protein. 
Um, one thing is, is you can catch bluegill with this and then uh, use the uh, parts of the bluegill to then fish for larger species such as catfish. And uh, you're set to go right out of your bag. Uh, unlike the Altoid 10, we all done the Altoid 10, anybody that's spending time in the outdoors. Um, you have to go find yourself your uh, limb, trim it down, notch it, tie it, to get ready to go fishing. Well, by the time someone gets their pole ready to go fishing, with this system here, I could probably have a couple of bluegill already set to go and thinking about starting my uh, cook fire for them. Now to use the Mark 1, what you want to do is you can go down to the uh, water side, turn over some rocks, turn over, roll over some logs till you find your bait, worms, insects, whatever. Choose the size of hook that you want for the appropriate size of fish that you might be going after, a small hook for a bluegill. You put it on your snap swivel after you've taken the rubber band off of it. Put your bobber on it so that you have it set for the depth you want to fish at. This is 550 paracord. Take the lanyard, put it through your wrist. As your line hangs down with your bait and bobber, hold it with your thumb. What you want to do is swing down, and as you swing up, release your thumb, and your uh, line will begin to unreel, and you're ready to start fishing. I would always suggest that you use the wrist lanyard just in case you would ever slip out of your hand you won't end up tossing your reel into the river or the lake so thank you for watching this video if the mark one is something that you would find useful please feel free to visit our website for more information and ordering or if you wish to contact us with an additional question you may do so through our website i will put the web address at the end of the video as well as in the uh, information box below. Thank you for watching and have a great day.